Hey guys, it's Jenny from Southern Savers. We're gonna head in and check out all the deals in Walgreens this week. There are a number, my favorites, definitely the completely free Revlon, thanks to a super high value $10 reward and the really great coupons that we have. There's also $1 shampoo, super cheap Old Spice deodorant, and a number of others. So let's head in and check out all the deals. It's a great week to get a good deal on razors in Walgreens. So this week, Gillette razors, various Gillette razors are on sale for $9.99. And we just got a $4 coupon in Sunday's paper. Now, these $4 coupons tend to be regional. So there is a possibility that you didn't get the $4 coupon, but hopefully you did. Grab your $4 coupon. This is $9.99. You're going to end up paying $5.99 after the coupon, and then you're going to get back a $3 register reward when you check out. So in the end, you are paying $2.99 for a brand new razor. It's much cheaper than really ever paying to get the blades. Just keep getting a new razor. Um, so this is going to be a limit of one. Because of that register reward, don't ever grab two. It will only print one register reward per transaction. So you don't want to go crazy here. Just grab one razor, one $4 off coupon, and pay $2.99. If your husband loves Old Spice, or you love Old Spice deodorant, this week you can get the cheap version, just the Old Spice Classic, on sale, and it's giving us a register reward back. So when you buy two of them, they are on sale for $2.99 a piece. Grab two of them and you are going to get back a $3 register reward. So guys, that's basically buy one get one right there after the reward. But we have a digital coupon. So grab two of them, scan the barcode with the Walgreens app. You're going to get $1 off when you buy two of them. Again, they're $2.99 a piece. So that's basically going to end up costing you, um, it would be $5.98, so they're $4.98 after the coupon then you're gonna get back a $3 reward. So they're 99 cents after the coupon and the reward. Super cheap if Old Spice is your brand. Gillette is also part of the deal. We see deals on Gillette um, actually uh, a fair bit. So I would go Old Spice just because the classic ones, it's rare for us to see the classic scent ever super, super cheap. And it can be a good one to grab. I don't know if you want to go stocking stuffer. That might be a little too cheap to put deodorant in someone's stocking, but um, pretty good price to stock up on if it's a brand that someone in your house will use. My favorite deal on storage bags and trash bags is back again this week. We see this usually once, if not sometimes twice a month. They put them on sale, buy one, and get two for free. So the regular price on these, $2.79 a box, $2.99 a box, the trash bags, not $2.79.2. So you're gonna grab three of them. There are no coupons here. This is just a Walgreens house brand. And you're gonna end up paying 99 cents or less for each box. It's a great price, way cheaper than we're gonna get the name brand. Um, so grab them if you need them, stock up. You do have to buy three. You can mix and match though and get some trash bags or some storage bags, but you do have to buy three to be able to get the sale price. Score shampoo, uh, conditioner, stylers for one buck this week. No rewards needed. Garnier Fructis products are on sale two for seven. We've got a store coupon in the monthly flyer, but you can also clip it straight to your Walgreens card. And we have a new manufacturer's coupon that is also digital or was in the inserts on Sunday. I would just go digital here. You can't really get any easier. So grab your Walgreens app, scan the barcode. It's gonna auto load as soon as you scan that barcode, the store coupon and all the digital coupons that are available. So I wanna grab two of them. My manufacturer is a $3 off two. The store coupon is a $1 off one, but it will come off on multiple products. So you're gonna buy two of them, it's gonna come off twice. So follow me here, two for $7. You have $3 off with the manufacturer. You have $2 off with two store coupons. Guys, that's five bucks in coupons. So cost seven minus five, you're now gonna pay two bucks for two bottles. So mix and match, grab whatever it is that you want, but it's a pretty sweet price to only pay a dollar for each item that you're grabbing and not even have to use the rewards program. There are two month long deals that are still running this week and we have really high value coupons for them. So I don't want you to miss them um, by not putting them in the video and sending you back to the monthly video for them. So if you wear contacts, blink contacts, 
Uh, we've got a store coupon in the month-long booklet for $3 off. We've got a $3 off manufacturer's coupon. So after that, you're gonna pay $1.79. That's just pairing those two coupons together and renew contact solutions. So I mentioned this in last week's video. It is also still $7.79. We have a $5 printable and a $2 store coupon. It's 79 cents after both of those. So if you wear contacts, these are two great deals for you to do the renew and the blink uh, and grab two items that you can use on a really good price and no rewards needed. One more great deal that's still available just using a digital coupon is Hallmark cards. So there is a store coupon for $3 off of two Hallmark cards and they start at two for four bucks. That's the route you wanna go. So grab two in the two for $4 area use your three dollar digital coupon and you're gonna end up paying 50 cents a piece for them now we've got other deals around town for 50 cent Hallmark cards um, Publix is another one so you can just stack up I went and grabbed blank cards because they're perfect to just send I'm thinking about you notes or happy birthday whatever you want to write on the inside um, so look for those in your store as well because then you know they're just usable whenever but don't miss this one. The store coupon expires on 1031. So it's a great deal to get Hallmark cards at a pretty good price. There's a sweet deal on cereal this week just to head in and grab a bunch of Kellogg's, whatever you want in Walgreens. So Kellogg cereals are a buck 88 and it's a bunch of different types of them. So you will see them all marked um, on the shelves. And we've got a lot of coupons here. So we've got printables. We have one from an insert. If you go back a ways, the last insert coupon was from August 25th. And we have a lot of Ibotta's. Here's the pressure. The Ibotta offers expire in the middle of this week. So you need to head in and you need to shop quickly. Um, this one, for example, after the Ibotta and the printable, 38 cents for a box of cereal. Even if you just went with the Ibotta offers, you're still gonna end up paying about $1.30, but I would definitely throw in the manufacturers if you can and stock up. So most of this is all gonna be less than a buck and as cheap as 38 cents, depending on the type that you grab. Mix and match, the limits on the Ibotta are limits of five, so you can go crazy on cereal if you want. The sale is good through October 26th. However, the Ibottas are gonna expire before the end of the week, so head to Walgreens and grab this one while you can. Okay guys, money maker deals on Revlon this week again. This week when you grab $15 worth of Revlon, you're gonna get back a $10 register reward, which is already pretty sweet all on its own. We don't normally see rewards that are this high in regards to, you know, you have to buy 15 and you get 10 bucks back. But we've still got these coupons, so grab your buy one, get one coupons, grab your $5 off coupons, mix and match items how you want. Make sure that you grab $15 before the coupons and you're gonna end up getting that $10 reward back. So there's a lot here that comes out to be free. One of your better options is possibly to go ahead and grab four items, use two buy one get one coupons and really maximize that if you can. Don't forget about color stay and the ongoing color stay offer too. Um, you're just needing to make sure that you buy enough uh, and that you, you know, you're covered after the coupons. But um, these are from the 10 six insert. So hopefully you have those, it's just a couple weeks ago, but they do, are, and they're actually good through the sale. I was going to say they expire soon, but we've got until 11 2 to use them. But this is probably your best week to do it if you haven't already. So stock up. The deal does include Revlon or Alme, and we do have good Alme coupons as well. So you can mix and match there, get whatever you are wanting. Um, but don't miss this deal. So that's a number of things to grab. In terms of the Revlon, let me show you what I did. I went for the cheaper products. So I grabbed Revlon Color Stay brow and Revlon color stay eyeliner these are both 879 so you can mix and match you can get the same whatever you wanted but they're 879 grab two of them and then I used points but two of them after your buy one get one coupon just after the coupon ten dollars and two cents pretty good that's with tax in my area remember you're getting back a ten dollar reward so I just paid a penny a piece after tax for both of those. Not bad. And I actually used points. So if you have some points, then in the end you can pay with your points. I literally paid two cents in cash for the whole thing um, and then got back the $10 register award. So not bad to be out of pocket four cents. I grabbed two deals of that and used two buy one get one coupons. 
My cashier was insistent that I could not use both of them in the same transaction. You really can. It says one per purchase, not one per transaction, but you know what? Sometimes you just gotta take it in stride. So I bought them in separate transactions. I was kind of hoping to test and see whether that $5 uh, additional color stay would print on the deal. Uh, it was a no-go uh, since he wouldn't take it. So um, you would need to grab four to be able to get that. It's not gonna view that you've purchased enough because this just two alone would have technically been 17 and over the color stay requirement, but it didn't print. Um, so grab four if you wanna grab it. Buying two of them though, paying two cents a piece, leaving with $20 in register rewards, not bad. Yes, I spent $20 in points, but I basically just exchanged points for register awards. Uh, and that's the happy way that, that system works. Now, one other tip for Walgreens, if you aren't a regular shopper, I always love to do a small transaction, hoping that one of these will print and then buy everything else. So I didn't grab a number of the deals that I mentioned. Um, I'm actually gonna go back in and grab um, some of them, a, a paper towel deal if I can find it in a different Walgreens. So not planning on shopping here, planning on actually hitting a different store. There is a deal on Sparkle paper towels this week, but this store doesn't even sell it. So I was kind of hoping to stock up on some paper towels um, just with a coupon. Sparkle paper towels come out to $3.74 for a six roll pack and I like that price. Um, so buy something small, see if one of these prints, and then buy the rest of the deals that you plan on buying. The only requirement here, don't pay with points, um, which is perfect for me. I now have $20 in register awards, so I can do that. It's not gonna mess up this transaction, and I'm gonna get an extra 5,000 bonus points for purchasing $20 worth of items before coupons not before points, so don't pay with points. But I love these when they print, uh, and usually they print on the first transaction of the week that you're gonna grab. So again, grab something little, see if one prints, and then grab your other items. Now remember, I went through a couple monthly deals today, but not all of them by far. So you do want to watch the monthly video. I'm gonna stick it up here at the end for 50 cent Bic razors and a number of other deals, including more paper good deals. Uh, um, so yeah, watch the video, make sure you grab them. All of the month long deals, we've got two more weeks on them, this week and next week, and then they're all gonna change. So hopefully you can get to the store by the end of next week and grab those as well as all of this week's deals. Head to southernsavers.com and you can print your shopping list. You can see all the coupons to use for the deals that I've mentioned and head straight into the store. My goal is that this is as easy as it can possibly get, guys. So you don't even have to do any work, just print the items that you want to grab and head in. So hopefully you can get to the store this week. All these deals end Saturday night, October 26th. Uh, thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe so that you can catch all of the weekly deals as I post them.